Hello everyone, welcome to a game called Air Mech Strike. This is apparently a pretty intense RTS game and uh, like fast paced RTS game and I'm curious to check it out. It's free to play on Steam. This is like the era of free to play games. There's tons of them. And so we can literally walk our guy around. It's kind of cool. Okay, shoot and destroy the enemy Bucky by holding... Alright, and dodge. Air Mech have unique abilities. Every time you level up, you get an ability point to spend. Click the icon to upgrade your power sword ability. Okay, this is interesting. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this game, what you think of it, if you like it. I'm curious to know if you play it yourself as well. Comment in the comments below if you have played it. Transform and fly back to your fortress. You can transform by pressing shift. Whoa, that's kind of cool. Hey, that's really cool. This is your fortress, which automatically produces infantry creep units that go into battle. If it is destroyed, you lose the match, so let's set up some defenses. Oh, cool. You can pick up units with your air mech. Fly over T-99 and press space. That's really sweet. Most structures have multiple auxiliary power sockets, which add bonuses to turrets and stationary units. Connect your T-99 to the socket by flying over it and pressing space. Everything's with space. Nice. Let's build some more units. All right. Build at least two jackals by hovering over the icon and pressing. Sweet. Okay, they're popping out here. Now, uh, there are five orders available to give you your units. Defend units. Defend. Units will return to the nearest friendly fortress and outpost. Units will stop where they are until given further orders. XCF. Units will follow your air mech. F and R. Units will attack the nearest enemy outpost. Units will bypass all enemy outposts and units attack enemy fortress. Okay, sweet. Some units can be picked up by any structure, uh, can be picked up from any structure you own by holding space. <laughs> Fly to an open area and drop units by pressing space. Cool. Give the jackals an order to, uh, by moving near them and pressing R. Interesting. So they're going over here to attack this. Once all unit, once all the units in an outpost are destroyed, you can capture by uh, getting four infantry units into the outpost. Okay, here comes my infantry units. They're going in, and that is now mine. Cool. Taking outposts increase your credit income and max army upkeep, and allows you to deploy units further up the battlefield. If you can capture all outposts, your enemy fortress will automatically be in taking damage. Okay, cool. Tutorial complete. Now that you know the basics, capture some additional outposts and destroy the damaged enemy fortress to beat Natasha. Alright, so let me go over here and... Uh, hold on a second. Let's go X for a second. We're going to go F. F. Come follow me. There we go. This is an outpost here. Um, let's do R. There they go. How do I transform back? So I'm getting money right now and I can build Patcher Longhorn. It's like a tank or something. Okay, and then I can take him, drop him off here. All right, so X is defend, C is hold position, F is follow, R is secure. Uh-oh. Attack! Oh, man. We're going to need a lot more units. Oh, 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 oh. We got it, I think. What's this thing? Holy crap, I can't attack that thing. Um, um, that's not good. Okay, level up. We leveled up. Hold on, let me just get like a massive assault unit here. Zipper. I'm going to do some jackals. I'm going to put him down there. We're just going to make a massive army here. Hard position! It's kind of a very, very, very limited range. You know, like it's really limited. In terms of like how far away they can go. Okay, so let's do um, R. Secure the position. 
Here they go. Now, how do I... How can I transform back, though? Like, from the air mech thing. And that was passive ability. Increases the build speed of your units. Interesting. And you can level that up again as well. Hold? Okay, interesting. I can fire! Oh, here's Natasha right here. You're done. You're done, Zo. This is a very interesting game. Um, how about you guys just follow me? How how do I get back down on the ground though? How do I transform back to this? And if I pump out soldiers, they'll just go on their own, right? Oh, here comes the soldiers right here. Oh, sweet! I can pick them. I can pick a bunch up at one time. Here we go. Everyone, just go. R. Oh, he's like standing guard over here. Natasha's back. Um, what are these? Stop following her, man. She's got like a. Uh, what was that? What kind of plane is that called? So we leveled up again. I still can't. Oh, I can't unlock this. Uh, hold uh, after quick burst. But how do I use just like if I want to just use that one? Holy smokes! This this game is definitely gonna take some getting used to. That's for sure. All right, let's see if we can pump out a bunch of this stuff. It's like artillery or something. T-99s. You gotta, it's kind of interesting you gotta pick everything up like that. So that's just securing. I, I kind of really want them to go and like attack on their own, you know what I mean? These guys are not really moving. I like that you can transform like that, but I can't figure out... I can't, like, transform back for some reason. Uh, activate the fire multiple moves against your enemy while in air or ground mode. What was that? Um, middle mouse button, I think. These guys aren't really... For, I don't think these guys move, do they? Yeah, these guys don't move. They're just like d defensive. So if I put like one down here, will they shoot at that? Oh, see, it's got to be in the radius. Hmm. Okay, there we go. Yeah, there's like a radius you have to be in. Dude, I'm like shredding her though. <laughs> okay, get wrecked. Natasha, I don't think you can uh, survive very long. Here we go. We're just going to keep moving these guys forward a little bit. Give them like some actual like defensive capabilities. Well, if I'm having this much problems like in an in a match like this, I'm going to have like even harder, like, even more problems like in an actual game against other players. <laughs> she can't even get anywhere right now. I think this is her like main base right here. Okay, middle moss button, right? Here we go. Salvo of shots coming out. And how long does it take? 11 seconds, okay. So that's like 11 seconds. This was right mouse button. Passive ability. That's right mouse button. Power sword. Take him out! Is it actually, like, attacking them? I think it is, right? Taking a long time though. There we go. Okay. We've like really secured this area here. Alright guys. We're going in for an attack here, okay? We're going in for an attack. She's gonna generate some more longhorns. But do I have to go they're gonna come out here? Oh okay, they do. Sweet.
There we go. Keep issuing the same command, which I guess is okay. Dude, we're just like loading up the Longhorns, though. This is her base. This is like the main base right here. I think it's all over, right? It's all over. There it is. It's all over! <laughs> this game is going to take some getting used to for me. I'm not used to playing RTS games. And I gotta get back into it. Practice victory took forever. We did horribly. So this is the garage right here. Um, double XP quests. We got level up. Collect that. Daily login. Getting started. Okay, so we got a bunch of gold and stuff. Um, shop. We can get buy different things. It looks like. Keys. What's this? DPS versus ground. It's a ground vehicle. Gangster. So you can buy different types of like units and stuff. It looks like you can maybe. Can you upgrade these or swap them out? Unit loadouts. Okay, so we got like a loadout that we can play with. Um, I think we got like a crate, a crest, a crate down here. You found a crate. XP boost cube. Yeah, I can invite a friend. Classic, what are these? Classic striker. We got different things that we can upgrade to, but we need to have those crystals, which is why where the free to play probably comes in play. Right click to inspect or unlock things. Yeah, so we gotta have uh, money for these. Everything costs money. Gothic striker. So these are that's pretty cool. Um, rankings, air max. Okay, sweet. So. Um, this is kind of the whole hub here. It doesn't look like we can upgrade our units with that because that wouldn't really make a ton of sense, but we can change our loadouts. First win, yeah, against the bot. Awesome. All right, so can we play against... I think there's like a campaign to this, isn't there? So there's a tutorial, quick play, training, challenge, and campaign. I'm kind of interested in doing this. Um, air make with action RPG set in an alternate feed. Okay, available on Steam. Oh, so there's like a, another whole game for the uh, campaign aspect? Challenge. Let's try a challenge. I don't know how if I'll make another one of these videos. I'm just really curious to see. Let's jump into Air Mech and see what you can do. Clear the training area of the enemy units to advance to the next challenge. Aim in the direction you want to shoot. Okay, so um, it's shift. Shift to transform. To go back to the mech and to the air. So this is it, huh? So you, you can hit shift. Well, I'm not doing it right now, but... Well then, how about we put you up against something that will shoot back? Okay, let's do it. Challenge number two. The long armor tanks will attack on sight, so proceed with caution. Most tank class units have weaker armor in the back. Okay. Now, I can't, I can't transform, unfortunately. Okay. He's shooting at me! Ooh, I think I took damage there, didn't I? I want to get to some good challenges. Maybe we'll play like a maybe we'll play something other than challenges. Hopefully, it gets harder as time goes on. Remember that you should attack air enemies from the air and ground from the ground. Change the ground mode. Okay. Oh, we got like a like a bomber here. What the heck, dude? Shit. There we go. Whoa! What the heck? Sweet, dude. We're taking tons of damage. Got like swords and stuff. Wow, it's taking forever to kill these things, though. Got a group of three here. Let's hit all these guys at one time. Dude. So, you could do like air and ground at the same time in a game, but like... I guess you can still shoot a ground units so. though. Like, even, you can still shoot a ground units when you're in the air. So, helping move units around is a unique feature. Press space to pick up the jackals and carry them across the gap. Interesting. See, these are just like tutorial challenges, really. Okay, I can only pick up one at a time. I thought I could pick up two. Oh, what a challenge, man. Whew! That was intense. That was, that was intense! And the whole point of these is probably to get you like used to the game. All station units will snap into sockets if dropped close enough. Or to put some in the practice for pick up the units and drop them onto the sockets as fast as you can. 
Oh, we got like a heli. Sweet. I forgot about the socket things. Forgot all about the socket things. I don't know what these are. I want to know what those things are. Tell me what they are, please. I want to hear. Shoot, uh, scoop up multiple units by holding space as you fly over them. Deliver the infantry to the front of the neutral outpost. Okay. Here we go. You can fly over. Oh, we almost had him. Yeah, we got to hold it. Crap, I forgot. There we go. Captured. That's really, it's really, it's really interesting. So we got, we collect, uh, what, what can we collect here? Level up. I can't collect these. Let me collect them. Okay, I can't. I'll probably have to do that from the main screen. Build some units to reach the, the target upkeep as quickly as you can. Units from your build queue will be automatically deployed on the ground. All right. Oh, to the, like this max target upkeep right here. Uh, I thought they get deployed on the ground. Why are you not putting them on the ground? We probably want to go with the cheapest option, don't we? You can have, you can have eight unit types in your army. Remember, you can spend your kudos in the shop to unlock new units. Your kudos, right, to unlock new units. Giving commands to a group of in units is a very important skill to master. Select the jackals, uh, jackals and order them to capture the outpost before your soldiers arrive. Alright, so we go like this. They're going to go capture it. Uh, that's a problem. There they go. I am taking a lot of damage. Yeah, I have to go in the ground to shoot them. What the heck? Yeah, so you can't shoot at the ground. I thought you could, but apparently not. Build four infantry to capture that nearby outpost. You have a few infantry units to choose from. Oh, I got like mechs and stuff? Runner, Sam, Probe. Let's do like one of each. Just do a bunch. No. So why, why aren't they automatically deploying on the ground? I thought they did, didn't they? Like, don't they come out automatically? I thought they did. Shoot them up! We need more, we need more stuff. Like, like, they come out the top. I thought they were, I thought they come out the bottom, like, automatically. I could have just put them down over there. I just don't understand. They were coming out, like, on their own. Maybe they were coming out of the outposts? Enemy units are in bond. You may want to build up a small defensive army in order to hold off the attack. Okay. We only have a couple options here. Okay, so those I can put down here when they pop up. Um, there we go. Pick it up, please. Um... I think we're okay. Put some more stuff. Get on the ground! Light him up! What the? See, you have to like go back up into this like every time. It's kind of weird. I don't think they work like that, do they? They're not working. Oh, yeah, they are working. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Oh, I can just hold it down, sweet. Oh, it's hurting. I think I respawn, don't I? Whoa. This game's actually going to be 
kind of difficult if I face real opponents, because this is not easy. Destroy all the enemies on the map. You are in a Warthog air mech, which has a powerful minigun. Press F1 to use the gun spray activated ability, allowing you to temporarily shoot ground units while in the air. Press to activate the shield power ability, increase your defense. Interesting. Okay. Here we go. Warthog. Yeah, boy. Destroy him! Now, I can probably do this. Drop a unit there. He's going to go inside to defend. And I can drop some... I'm going to drop these with me and have them follow me. I think that'll be the best course of action. Get some of these armadillos, too. The armadillo. Oh, I just now realized there's a chat down there. This kind of takes a long time to have these spawn up, don't they? We've got a spin up. Guns. And the shield, which is middle mouse button. Have to keep that in mind. Alright. <clears throat> You're all going to follow me. There we go. I'm generating income, too over time. Honey pot, T99. Are these, this is like a twin tank right here, isn't it? You don't have enough credits to build that. I know it's taking a while, but I'm just like kind of experimenting just to see what happens. Just to see what they do. We only have 18 things to destroy. Okay, that's probably good. Let's go. Activate. Look at that, just spray and pray. We could capture like the the ground the uh there we go. Drop those. Can I get No, I don't want to secure. I want them all to f let's go I'm gonna go on the ground. Just cuz. I think I do, do I do more damage when I'm on the, in the air? What do I kind of look like? There's the shield thing. Move out! It's kind of a sweet mech game. Yeah, that was kind of a waste. I didn't have to probably do all that. They're actually targeting me. The, the main base was targeting me in there for a second. It's because I was like the furthest one out or what? Huh, interesting. Guys, let me know what you think of this game, and if you want to see more, I I'd be interested in bringing more to you. I just don't know what to think of it so far, especially like playing against other people. Take over both outposts. The enemy is reinforcing them with infantry, so you'll need to take them out. Try placing the provided turret to the right of the enemy outpost to cut off their reinforcements. It's a lot of like micromanaging, you know? A lot of micromanaging. Tango. Let's do like these runners. Some longhorns. To the right of the outpost. Could probably pick this up just a little bit more, bring it into range. Now I think it'll attack all that stuff. Where are my. Here we go. Like where are my freaking units at? Go! Gonna secure. All secure. Now we shoot. Now we shoot. Dude, they're just popping those out like crazy. Need runners. Hope I can't do it when I'm in the air. Ah. Okay, there we go. We're gonna go in. Oh, that's it? Interesting. Yeah, guys, let me know what you think. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next one.